everyone, and today we're starting a new series. We're going to play Fallout New Vegas. Now, some of the avid, long-time viewers of my channel may remember that I tried uh, a Let's Play of Fallout 3 about two years ago, and the game just kept crashing on me. So, uh, let's hope that doesn't happen this time. Um, yeah, without further ado, let's begin Episode 1, or as I like to call it, Vault 1. <laughs> that was terrible. And so if anyone's familiar with the, or not familiar, with the Fallout series, it's set after a Great War, which is a, um, which was when all of the different countries attacked each other with nuclear weapons, um, there was a whole lot of secret military action happening before, uh, with the US, and they were, uh, experimenting with an FEV virus, which basically mutated people, and of course the radiation has mutated um, people too, so there are lots of different weird creatures and things, and unusual people out in the wasteland. And this one is set in what was Las Vegas, and is now known as New Vegas. Look at that. Oh yeah. Travelling through the air. His head exploded. Beautiful. And that would be the Legion here. There are a whole lot of different, um, different tribes and uh, different factions in this game that you're dealing with. War. War never changes. And now Ron Perlman will say something. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam just barely against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. My hands, Guess why are they tired? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? It's Chandler from Friends. Oh. Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. That's something you'll never forget. You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. Aw, what's he doing? From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is... 
game was rigged from the start. Oh my god. What an opening. What an opening. Okay. What happens now? Where are we? We've been shot in the head. Who knows? Well, I know I've, I've played the game before, but I'm sure a lot of you have played the game before, but who knows? Apart from us. And lots of other people. Someone, I'm sure. Ooh. Now all the stupid mod packs will load. This is the Game of the Year edition, by the way, if you're um, interested in getting it on Steam. It comes with everything. Um, Ooh. I am not oh, good. How about that? Well, how about that? Whoa, easy there. <gasps> easy. You've been out I like your mustache. It's you very great. Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage It is. looks like Patrick Stewart with a mustache. Can you tell me your name? Um, yes, Courier. Me, Courier. You, man. You, you, Patrick Stewart. Uh, let's call him Ed. But let's say that he he's not me. He, he's not you know a version of me. He's a he's a different Ed, an Ed who's been through the uh, the perils of post-apocalyptic uh, careering, careering, careering. I don't know, taking stuff around in a post-apocalyptic setting. He's a different Ed, a worn Ed, a tired Ed, an Ed who's been shot in the head, a shot in the head Ed. Can't say it's what I'd have picked for hey. you, but if that's your name, that's your name. Don't don't be rude about my name. Welcome to Good Springs. Oh, thank you. Now, I hope you don't mind. Are there any Good Springs around here? Little rooting around there in your noggin <laughs> to pull all the bits of lead out. <laughs> I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. Well, how the hell would I know? <laughs> if I'm bleeding, I you probably have. <laughs> all right. Is is my face the same? <laughs> um, well, for for starters, I was a female before. I mean, completely changed me. Um, yes, okay, race. Uh, let's stick with Caucasian. I'm not being racist here. I'm just I I am Caucasian. So, but maybe maybe this Ed is a Hispanic Ed who's been through so much that he's grown a very very bushy beard. Or, or he's an Asian or an African American. Okay, I'm just gonna stick with Caucasian. Uh, face preset one, preset two. Pre oh, that's lovely. We could do all of the ridiculous customizations. I'm not sure. Let's see if we can find a nice preset. No, <laughs> no, he's too tribal. He's too old by the looks of it. He's like a slightly darker colored Patrick Stewart. He's like Patrick Stewart with. Handlebar moustache. Everyone is just clearly Patrick Stewart here. I mean, ah, he's okay. He looks like he looks like the first one. Maybe ten actually. Now he looks too. I don't know. All right, we'll go with nine. But then we'll change it up a bit. Let's see. Um, I can't even. What? They're blue. Okay, we'll make them hazel. Uh, tone shape. No, that's good. Um. Age. Well, I'm fairly young, so we'll just keep it at the. I assume that that doesn't mean he's like one or two years old. I assume he starts around, you know, 20 or something. So that would be ideal. Uh, hair. Hairstyle. Not clean cut. Pompadour. No, definitely not. <laughs> no. It's just. It's, it's just all Patrick Stewart again. Why, why, there's nothing good. Punked. <laughs> the Unsettler. No, that's just... Blastback. Blastback's okay. Mm, yeah, yeah, maybe. High Rise. Oh, that's the end. Okay. It's between these last three, I think. But you probably can't change it afterwards. Mm, maybe Blastback. It's not, a, it's not accurate for me, but... But I'm not this Ed, this is a different Ed. Uh, a hard-boiled Ed, if that makes sense. Hair color. 
uh, what are the different chocolate? I have a chocolate hair. Corn silk, platinum, suede, pecan, auburn, ginger, honey, gold, gold, ro rosewood. What color is your hair? I like to think of it as a rosewood colored. It's very beautiful. Chestnut, steel, champagne. Uh, let's let's go chestnut. Put it. Facial hair, facial hair. He needs something. So no. <laughs> Rough beard's good. No, no. Oh yeah, <laughs> beautiful. The gentleman. No, no, <laughs> no. The Gettysburg. Oh dear. No, no. Honest Dave. No. These are all <laughs> ladies, man. Okay, no, I'm dead you. They're all moustaches. Why are they all moustaches? I mean, I know it's November, but why? Why? Uh, God, that there's just no <laughs> Okay, I'm going with the um, rough beard. That looks good. Sort of, sort of. I mean, it looks messy, but it'll do. Yes, this is my character. Yeah, most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. Rest you whatever no doesn't matter. Keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Wow, dizzy. I'm dizzy. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Ooh. Over by that big That is the biggest challenge I've ever had in my Take life. It, slow now. it ain't a race. Okay. Oh, what? Hang on. There we go. Go nice and slowly. How do I change the camera angle? So far. I can't remember. I can't remember how to there we go. Boom, 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 boom. boom. He's a very muscular man. He's been, you know, had to build up for, for the wasteland. Uh, what are we doing here? I can't remember how this thing works. Strength. Oh, all right. Yeah. Strength nine. Uh. Well, he seems very muscular. Let's make him a, a beach bully. <laughs> he seems like a beach bully. Perception. Oh, I don't have that many points left. Okay, hang on. Let's drop that down to six. Um. Exclusive locks. Okay, yeah, this is actually fairly important. Let's make it six as well. Endurance can probably stay at five, I reckon. Unarmed, health resistance, survival. Well, if we're careful, that should be okay. Charisma. I like to think I'm fairly charismatic. Let's let's make that six. Intelligence. Yeah. yeah. How many more are there? If if we need more somewhere else, we'll bring that down. Agility is okay for five. Luck. Maybe we'll make luck six because um. Ah. I think that's quite good. Six six five six six five six. Six six five six six five six. Perfect. That's my that's my final answer. Oops, how do I leave? Yes, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> ding yeah, ding. That's a pretty standard score there. You're a pretty standard well, person. You know your vitals are good. Can I just take this? Bullets, you leave you Yay. What do you Where'd say? Where'd he go? You Where'd he go? My couch and we go through a couple of questions. Why don't you Seat take a dog. seat on my couch? Okay. Okay, Doc. Let's let's have a seat. All right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Uh. Kick. No. Uh. <laughs> train. House. <laughs> Shelter. Night. Uh, yeah, dream. Bandit. Kill. Va vaporize. Light. Dark. Father. There's no father. Regret. <laughs> Human shield. No. Uh, let's say caretaker. Okay. Now, I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one, conflict just ain't in my nature. 
Um, uh, agree. No, maybe not, because they'll probably want to kill lots of people. And then that would be going against what I've already said. No, no opinion. I ain't given to relying on others. For I support. ain't given to relying on others. Uh, I would say strongly agree. It's gonna be I'm very lonely out in the, the, in the wasteland. Attention. Fixing to be center of things. Oh, strongly agree. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Uh, I disagree. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Yeah, that's kind of me. Almost done here. As in, what do you say you I don't use stealth it? in games. Tell me what you see. Clearly, that's what it is. Um, I see an oozing wound. No. Probably, I don't know, an oozing wound. Why not? Okay. How about this one? Um, I'm too embarrassed to say what it looks like. Yeah. Last one. A bearded man. <laughs> How's that mushroom? Oh yeah, I see. All right, a head on a pillow. Let's say a mushroom cloud. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. <laughs> see if it all seems right to you. Let's see what I'm like. Explosives. So focus on explosives, medicine, and speech. I would change it to focus on, I'll leave medicine because that's useful, change that to focus on energy weapons because I am a big energy weapons person. Um, yeah, speech is probably good. Uh, cool. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. Okay, you what's that? Out, so I can get a sense of is this why I'm not wearing any pants? Just a formality. Ain't like Expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Oh, I do. My father was shot in the head. Uh, choose up to two traits or none. Okay. Um, I think bloody mess, which was in previous games uh, and just made everything a lot more violent, is basically just turned on now. But it might be unlocked later. I can't really remember. Let's see what we got. Build to destroy the flame of the burns. Equipment. Okay. Claustrophobia. Gain plus one to special tributes when outside. No. Um, no, I don't want to lose accuracy. Good natured. Plus five to those. Minus five. No. I will not lose my energy weapon skills. Hoarder. Plus twenty five to your cannon. But suffer a minus one to all attributes any time the weight you're carrying drops below one hundred sixty. Oh. <laughs> No, maybe not. I do like to carry a lot, but if I want to drop it all off somewhere, that's kind of crap. Um, ooh, wild Wasteland, definitely. That's just weird encounters out in the Wasteland. I'll definitely have that on. Trigger this one, why using 20 foot a bit more? Mm, maybe. Loose cannon. Can throw weapon 30% faster. Kamikaze. Mm, maybe not. Mm, 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 mm. There's not much there. I wonder if I just choose one trait now, does that mean I have another trait to unlock the next level that we go up? I might, but I can't remember. Let's let's just choose one. Uh, let's choose trigger discipline. I know it's a bit slower, but I do like my accuracy. I'm a bit of a ranged person, so. Come with me. I'll see you out. I'll see you at the door. I'll see you outside. Very sad day to lose you, sir. Come on, come on, Patrick, leave me. This way to the door. This is the exit from my house. Here, these are yours. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Was all you had on you when you was brought in. Thank you very much, Patrick I Seward. Fine, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin. But it was just something about a platinum chip. Ooh. 
Well, if you're heading foreshadowing there, you ought to have this. or backward shadowing in the story. Boy. Backward shadowing. I That's grew up in one of them vaults in May before the war. We and then they are vaults. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. So much pain in this man's life. The locals don't pick on you for lacking modesty. Never was much my style anyway. You shouldn't have gone through my stuff. <laughs> uh, maybe I should say what do I do now? You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely She'll be, be at the down saloon. at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But well, try not okay to be then. Killed anymore. Uh. Oh yes. Now, do we want to play hardcore? I've played it through with hardcore, I think, before, and I can't remember what the special reward was, which means it probably wasn't that great. So I'm gonna say no. Just because I like to, you know, run around and do stupid things, and that'll screw me over. 